beauties, this is Sam from Instant Beauty. Uh, so I work daily with uh, quite a few clients and you know I get asked questions all the time um, you know just about general hair care tips and hair extension tips as well um, but uh, definitely the hair tips is something that I'm going to be focusing on because you know I mean hair is the base for extensions so um, so to be honest what I did was I made a massive list of, uh, of all my tips and I realized that it would probably be a feature length film if I did the video all at once so I'm going to be splitting it up into uh, about four videos so that you guys can have uh, have all the tips but you know you watch them at your leisure. <laughs> so as I mentioned we are going to be making a series of uh, hair tips um, and they're just going to include you know general hair care tips and styling tips and uh, maybe a couple extension tips here and there. Um, but uh, hopefully you enjoy them and uh, hopefully they help you because they definitely help me and uh, my clients. So tip number one um, is to always pat your hair dry with a towel instead of rubbing. Um, this is a great tip for anybody, anyone with, uh, with extensions or without. Um, and the reason that you, are sh you should never um, just rub your hair like aggressively with a towel is because it causes frizziness, um, it could cause breakage. Um, drying it's it's actually it can tangle your hair further it's it's really not a good thing to do um, so you always want to make sure that you pat gently um, and the, the best thing to do first is when your hair is wet is just gently squeeze out any excess water so that it helps to um, dry your hair faster so basically what you want to do to pat your hair dry is just very simply get your towel and just sort of pat it very very gently just to absorb all the water um, so that way you're not you know, rubbing it aggressively and causing breakage or fizziness or damage. So tip number two is the benefit of a cool rinse. So this is probably one of my favorite tips of all time. Um, I always do this just before I get out of the shower. I give my hair a nice cool rinse. I mean, nothing too cold. You don't want to, you know, freeze, but um, it's nice. It feel, first of all, it feels really nice and um, it is really beneficial for your hair. What happens is the cold water um, closes the, the hair cuticle so then you have a less frizzy style when you do blow dry your hair. Um, it's, also, it's also less damaging for your hair. It also leaves your hair very, very shiny and more manageable. So my third tip, third tip. So the third tip is to put lemon juice in your hair to create natural highlights. So this tip really only works with natural hair. Um, natural hair meaning hair that hasn't been processed with chemical like dyes, bleach, or perm solution. So what you need to do is get a real lemon and squeeze the juices out of it. Mix in a little bit of water and uh, you can even use your fingers just to distribute it through your hair. Um, sit up in the sun for an afternoon or so and then you might have some natural highlights. So the fourth tip is to give yourself an oil treatment about once a month. Um, one of the great oils you can use is extra virgin olive oil. It really moisturizes your hair and you'll notice a big difference. So you want to apply the oil uh, generously to your hair and I mean a great tip would be to do this and have it in uh, overnight but you do want to make sure that you wrap your hair um, so you don't create a big mess so you can use plastic or uh, probably plastic would be the best thing because if you did use a towel the oil might seep through but um, afterwards when you rinse your hair you'll notice your hair is going to feel so nice so moisturized um, and uh, it's going to be gorgeous. So the fifth and final tip for this video is to air dry your hair as frequently as possible. Um, I always recommend this to my clients, um, every single client, to air dry their hair as often as possible. Um, and this works for so many reasons. So, I mean, first of all, you're, you're applying less heat to your hair for your um, typical hair routine. Um, your hair can dry naturally, which can give you some beautiful loose waves if your hair texture does that. Um, and also, I mean, what you're doing is overall and over time a lot less damage to your hair okay guys that's it for this video if you have any tips you know feel free to leave them down below and if you have any questions let us know um, be sure to watch the rest of our series and uh, we'll see you guys soon bye so that's it for this video guys um, you know leave your tips 